welcome to Hella Silt for now. We're just waiting in the car. We're going to take a car ferry to Geiranga today. So Geiranga is a very famous fjord in Norway. It's famous for being very scenic. It's got lots of waterfalls and things like that. So we're waiting to take the ferry, which will take us into Geiranga port. The ferry itself is kind of a mixture between a normal car ferry and like a touristic ferry. So it takes about an hour and there's like an audio guide, I think, along the way because it's a very beautiful place. So we're just waiting to do that now. It's currently like 9.15 in the morning and our boat's at 9.30. It is a bit rainy today, but we are in Norway. So that's kind of just how it is, I think. Yesterday was beautiful actually, but today it's raining. And it's supposed to rain all day, but we will see what we can do. There's lots of hikes and things we can do in the area, so we'll just see how the weather is basically. And that's kind of the plan, so do you have anything to say? No? no? I need a coffee. I'm wanting to get a coffee on the boat. I'm very sleepy. But see you later. <laughs> Just come up to the lounge area. It's pretty fancy actually. Like it's it's way fancier than the other one we got. So this is very nice. There's a nice cafe over there where I will get coffee <laughs> now. I wonder. Sky sometimes hides behind the clouds. Maybe it's just like me, a little bit scared of heights. Why does the rain always keep on pouring down when it's gray outside? It really makes me wonder. now so we got off the ferry and we went straight up to a viewpoint which I don't know what it was called fly something flies just <laughs> or something it was a beautiful viewpoint over Geranga um, so we stopped there for a little bit and took some shots and we got out the drone and took some lovely drone shots over the fjord ah breath already <laughs> it's hard to walk and um, to talk and hike at the same time that's fine so there's quite a lot of hikes you can do around Geranga. So we are doing one of them now. This is our view. We just passed. We started basically at this restaurant that's just behind us and they have a farm with like llamas in the field, which is very random for Norway, but there you go. So that was pretty cute. We're planning to do sort of two kind of very short, quite easy hikes, just kind of along the the edge of the fjord um, to get in the views and everything like that and look at some more viewpoints basically. So for now the rain is holding out and it's, it's quite nice. <laughs> so we'll see how we get on. <laughs> we made it to our hike. So this is the view behind us. It looks very dramatic on this camera actually. Yeah. So this is a point called Lostad. It's just started to rain. I don't know if you can see it, but it was about a 40 minute hike from Geranga. So it's, it's pretty short and it's quite easy to be honest. So it's definitely worth doing just to come up and see a different viewpoint of the fjord, but very nice. That's all I have to say to be honest. I have a lot else to say. That's it. And then we're going to walk back into town and try and find some lunch, I think, because I'm getting hungry. So for lunch, we have svele, which is like a Norwegian style pancake basically. So mine is with jam and sour cream, and you have brunost, which is like the caramelly cheese, right, for sweet things, and a teeny cafe. <laughs> okay, so we came to another place for dessert. We've got these waffles with chocolate. It's actually a chocolate like shop. They make it here. Very cute. You ready? Healthier. The dessert of the dessert. The dessert of the dessert. <laughs> okay, we've had our lunch and now we're hiking again. <laughs> so we're doing another short hike. I think in total it's probably two hours. And this one is to go and see a nice waterfall. So rather than a viewpoint, it's a bit different. And you said online that we could maybe walk behind yeah. it. Yeah. 
That's so, what it said. We'll see what it's like basically, but it sounds, in theory, sounds quite fun. So that's our another mini hike of the day that we are starting now. <laughs> because we basically did all we needed to do there and there wasn't a lot else to do. So we started driving to where we thought was a nice wild camping spot. Little did we realize it was quite high up and not even like ridiculous, like 600 meters up. And it was so deep in snow that there was just no way that we could stop there in our little tent. So we've kind of been forced to continue um, driving to where we were supposed to be camping tomorrow, which means currently we're doing Trollstigen, which if you don't know, is a very famous road in Norway because it's kind of treacherously goes down the mountainside. But as you can see out the window, we can't see anything. Um, so we're gonna see how this goes and take it very, very slowly. Manu's doing some expert driving here. But yeah, for now it's a bit treacherous conditions. 